Hi, beautiful people. Welcome to my YouTube channel. This is your girl, Nosy Rosie, where I do reaction and commentary videos. We are gathered today for another reaction video. Remember, this video is for entertainment purposes only covered by fair use. Please be kind to everyone, everywhere, especially in the comment section. Please do not show hate to anybody. Okay, with that being said, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much. Let's get into it. Hey, beautiful people. This is your girl, Nosy Rosie, and we are back with another video. Today, we will be reacting on My Jazzy Life's new video that she just posted today. And here we go. So, basically, the overview of her video. The video came on and... Ava um, was doing a breathing treatment or whatnot because she does have asthma. Um, so after that, she kind of, my jazzy life, um, got a package from some of her subscribers and it was formula and some cookies. So that was nice or whatever. And she definitely thanked her subscriber for that. Um, after that, she got the kiddos out of the door, um, I guess she had packed their little bags or whatever, and she got the kiddos out the door um, to go. So then Legendary apparently had an appointment. So Chris took him to the appointment or whatever. That was cute and everything. He took him to the appointment. Um, and after the appointment, Jazzy said that, you know, the baby's, baby Legendary's head is doing well and he might not need a second helmet okay so that was cool um i think she called her mom because she needs to call her back and then she jumps into kind of like a little q a situation um where she just kind of gave a little bit of background a little bit excuse me of background on why she started youtube and basically you know she was in college and she was working and had a baby and she really just kind of needed to um she needed to earn some extra income and she wanted to be you know be with her children because daycare is expensive so she really really started taking youtube serious when she had the twins when they were a couple months old and yeah she just kind of explained that and that she you know her children motivated her to keep going forward um which is great you know what i mean and then that was pretty much it okay so um basically my thoughts and opinions on the video i thought the video was it was cool it was you know it was really nothing really too much going on it was just like a quick snippet of like a day in the life for her you know what i mean um i thought it was um good that chris definitely took legendary to the doctor's appointment because most of the time damn near all the time we see jazzy taking legendary to the appointments and we kind of question like okay well why isn't chris there kind of what's going on so it was good to see him taking his son to the doctor's appointment while jazzy had other things to do she had to go to an appointment herself so that was cool or whatever um, but anyway, I mean, the video was, you know, kind of lackluster. There was nothing really too much going on. You know, the kids look great, um, as always. They're super cute. And, um, yeah, so that was pretty much it. But one thing that I can say um, for the video, one thing that kind of piqued my interest was when she was telling her story about um, how she started YouTube and she was just like, you know, my her money grew and so she decided to move out um, of her mother's house and get her own place. And she was just like, you know, I'm so, you know, grateful and thankful and look at me now, I'm in a home. I would have, who would have believed it, right? And so for me, I'm thinking to myself, okay, all of that is true, you know, but you are in a home that you do not own. And that's, that's, the issue for me in this video um because she needs to take things a little bit more serious when it comes to um being stable in the places that she lives she has moved several times from several different places from apartment to house to house you know what i mean and i just think that she needs some stability so what i would say my 
um, advice would be is to prepare yourself, my jazzy life, to become a homeowner because anything could happen. You know, the the um, your landlord they could sell the house, they could just want you out, you know, and then you have to move to a completely different home and that's not that's not stable at all you know what i mean so i would say get your finances together and try to be a homeowner you know and there's several different things that you have to do to become a homeowner and for me i just think that it would be great to start getting your credit together okay because that's definitely important making sure that you know your debt to income ratio um, is it will suffice to buy a home, you know, get rid of all the debts that you have. Um, I don't, you know, know her personally, so I don't know what kind of debt she has, but you know, like 90% of people have debt. So lowering debts, paying off things and making sure that you're paying things on time. Um, you know, and it, because it's, it's very important. Okay. It's very important. Um, not only that, making sure that you know how much you can afford, because when you go to, to, um, a, you know, apply to get a home or fill out an application with a mortgage broker, they're going to say, okay, where well, you are approved for say 300,000, but in actuality, really, you know, that you really can't afford 300,000. You really can afford 200,000. So just making sure that you know what you can afford, you know what I mean? And then, my jazzy life, you really need to save, save. And I'm, you know, I'm not saying that you don't have savings. I'm just giving my advice. You definitely need to save for a down payment and closing costs, okay? And down payment and closing costs, that can be upwards of $20,000, $30,000. So, it's time to start doing that. It's time to start focusing on that. You know what I mean? And then know kind of what kind of loans you will be approved for. You have conventional loans, FHA loans, uh, VA loans. I'm not sure. I don't think you or Chris have been um, in the service, but, you know, it's different loans out here. Um, so just kind of just like you researched YouTube and you became great at that or decent or good at that to um, so where you can make money for your family. Well, it's time to do some research on buying a home and getting prepared okay so that's what i have to say for this video thank you all for coming and checking out this video if you like this video please like comment and subscribe i really appreciate you all please come back to see your girl nosy rosy Mwah.